Imagine a small city bustling with ceaseless activity, where every citizen knows their exact role and works together to ensure the community's well-being. There's no chaos, no disagreements, just harmonious cooperation and remarkable efficiency. This isn't a science fiction story or a human utopia. This is the astonishing reality of ant life. Beneath the ground, inside wooden cavities, or even within the cracks of urban concrete, ant colonies lead highly organized and intriguing lives. They are architects, soldiers, foragers and caretakers, all working tirelessly for the survival and prosperity of their colony. How do these tiny creatures organize themselves so effectively? What is the secret behind their highly structured social hierarchy? Ants are one of the most successful and diverse groups of insects on the planet. They are found almost everywhere, from tropical rainforests to urban areas. Despite their small size, ants play a crucial role in many ecosystems and exhibit complex social behaviors that are both fascinating and important for the environment. Colonies are organized in a highly structured social hierarchy. At the top of the hierarchy is the queen, whose primary role is to reproduce. There can be one or several queens in a colony, depending on the species. The workers, which are all female, are responsible for foraging, caring for the young, and maintaining the nest. Males have a singular purpose, to mate with the queen, and typically die soon after fulfilling this role. Each ant in a colony has a specific role. Worker ants are divided into different castes based on their tasks. Some are foragers, collecting food and bringing it back to the nest. Others tend to the larvae, ensuring they are fed and protected. There are also soldier ants, which protect the colony from predators and other threats. Leafcutter ants are a prime example of a well-organized colony. They cut and carry leaves back to their nest to cultivate fungus, which is their primary food source. The division of labor is evident, with larger workers cutting leaves and smaller ones tending to the fungus gardens. Ants primarily communicate through chemicals called pheromones. These pheromones can convey various messages, such as the location of food, alerts about danger, or signals to coordinate activities. When a forager ant finds a food source, it leaves a pheromone trail back to the nest, which other ants follow. Ants exhibit remarkable cooperative behaviors. For example, when transporting large food items, several ants will work together to move it back to the nest. This cooperation extends to nest building, 
where ants collectively dig tunnels and construct chambers. Ants are considered ecosystem engineers because they modify their environment in ways that benefit other organisms. Their tunneling aerates the soil, which improves its quality and aids plant growth. Ants also help in seed dispersal, as they carry seeds back to their nests, where some seeds can germinate and grow. Ants are both predators and prey in their ecosystems. They hunt various insects and even small vertebrates, playing a role in controlling pest populations. However, ants are also prey for many animals, including birds, reptiles, and mammals. The life cycle of an ant begins with the queen laying eggs. These eggs hatch into larvae, which are cared for by the worker ants. The larvae undergo several stages of growth before pupating and eventually emerging as adult ants. The development from egg to adult can take a few weeks to several months, depending on the species. Reproduction involves swarming, where winged males and females leave their nests to mate. After mating, the males die, and the fertilized females shed their wings and establish new colonies. This process ensures the spread and survival of the species. Army ants are known for their nomadic lifestyle and massive swarming events. They do not build permanent nests but instead form temporary living nests called bivouacs, moving constantly in search of food. Many ant species provide benefits to humans. For instance, they help control pest populations in agricultural fields, reducing the need for chemical pesticides. Ants also play a role in decomposing organic matter, contributing to nutrient cycling in ecosystems. However, some ants can be problematic. Species like the red imported fire ant can cause painful stings and damage crops. Carpenter ants can infest wooden structures, causing significant damage to buildings. Ants are some of the most intriguing and successful creatures on Earth with over 12,000 known species inhabiting almost every corner of the globe. Their ability to adapt to various environments means they thrive in diverse habitats. Their complex social structures, sophisticated communication methods, and interactions with their surroundings make ants a consistently fascinating subject worthy of study. Understanding ants and their behaviors not only deepens our appreciation for these small yet powerful insects, but also highlights their importance in maintaining ecological balance. Ants play vital roles in global ecosystems by controlling pest populations, recycling nutrients, and aerating the soil. 
By exploring the unique characteristics and behaviors of ants across different countries, we can better appreciate their essential roles in ecology and the remarkable social structures they form.